Well, good morning from uh, Tachikawa, Tokyo. Uh, I'm in Tachikawa. Um, it's a city full of memories for me, and I will get into why in a minute. Uh, just uh, thought I'd walk around before I basically head over to my office. Uh, well, not my office, but uh, the office I have to go to. Um, the office isn't open yet. Uh, uh, as you can see, I am in a suit uh, wearing a. Uh, uh, as you can see, I am in a suit uh, wearing a black tie, and uh, there's a reason for that. I'm just kind of walking uh, to a specific uh, place, just a place, just to uh, kind of say hello. Um, and that is uh, good morning, Colonel. That is uh, coming up here in a second. Uh, but yeah, this is Tachikawa. Um, I'll get back to the station uh, in a few minutes. Uh, my uh, the office isn't open, so it's good that a few minutes. Uh, my uh, the office isn't open, so it's good that I'm actually uh, walking around with y'all right now. Just you know, a bunch of local businesses around here. This is one of the streets in uh, Tachikawa, and. Uh, so yeah, this is uh, the place. So this here, um, I was here about uh, about two weeks ago um, with a friend of mine. Uh, we basically had uh, some drinks and uh, things like that, and I just wanted to come visit. Um, just a little hole in the wall kind of place, but uh, you know, it was very friendly. Um, as you can see, I'm just on one of these streets here and the station is just down there. Um, we did park actually uh, in this parking lot here and um, well, basically why I'm here is uh, I was here with a friend of mine um, two weeks ago, like I said. And uh, unfortunately, uh, I got the news uh, that my friend uh, suddenly passed away um, over the weekend. And I'm going uh, to his memorial today. Uh, I have black tie, black suit on today. Um, so it's kind of a sad day, but it's full of memories. I wanted to uh, you know, share a little bit with you guys as to uh, why I'm out here uh, showing you Basically, um, <coughs> Tachikawa, I used to live out here. Hey, good morning, Dante. Um, and uh, yeah, I worked out here for a long time. Hey, good morning, John. And yeah, it's just, it's been a real shocker over the weekend. Um, just a, uh, a young, he was young, 53. Um, and I don't really want to talk about it too much. But, uh, yeah, just, uh, boom, it just happened. I found out yesterday. Um, it's pretty sad. But uh, I thought, uh, you know what, why not uh, do another walk around? Hey, Jose. Um, and, uh, yeah, basically kind of show you. Hey, greetings all. Hit that thumbs up for Drew. Help me feel a little better in these hard times. Thank you, sir. Uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's kind of hard. It's going to be harder tonight uh, when I go to the memorial, but um, yeah, I don't want to dwell on it. Uh, just uh, wanted to go visit that uh, place where, you know, I was with him last time. Um, I had a meeting and then him and I had, you know, personal talk for a couple hours and it was, it felt really good to, uh, you know, to hang out with him for a while. Um, but, uh, you know, life is like that, I guess. So, so yeah, let's uh, walk around a little bit of Tachikawa. I'll go over to the station area a little bit. Um, <clears throat> Tachikawa, I'm about 45 minutes west of Shinjuku um, on the Chuo Line train. It depends on what train you take. If you take a, a longer train, I mean a, a ra commuter rapid, it might take 35 minutes. Pizza and wine. Like, does it get any better than that? Well, I guess pizza and beer would be better. All pizzas are 500 yen. That's pretty cool. 
Oh, there I am. Um, so yeah, we're gonna just walk walk around a little bit of Tachikawa. It's basically like any other, you know, area, station area that you're gonna see. Um, I really don't know what is so special about Tachikawa. Um, my, you know, my personal memories is uh, from living out here and working here about 10 years ago. Um, up until about uh, January of this year, I used to uh, work in this area part-time kind of thing. Um, so yeah, this is the station area here. That's uh, Tachikawa Station. Uh, then if you go over here, there's another station. I don't know what train it is. It's like a monorail almost. And uh, it's not very busy here this morning. But the stores aren't open yet either, so. Which, you know, hey, it is what it is, so. All these different malls. On the other side of the station, when I get to, uh, over there, you'll see like Bit Camera. Hey, Charles! Long time no see. Um, it's, uh, I like the other side better, kinda, I guess. Looked up the area on Google Maps, looks like a nice area. Uh, it is a nice area. Um, it's, uh, you know, like, a lot of people when they come to Tokyo, you're looking sharp, thank you. Um, I'm dressed up for a reason. <laughs> um, a lot of people when they, when they come to Tokyo, they always want to hit like, uh, yeah, it is rainy. They always want to hit Shinjuku and uh, Shibuya and places like that. And, and by all means, right? Like, you know, those are the places that tourists go and, you know, all the big lights and everything like that. But if you ever get a chance to go on the Chuo line west of Shinjuku, um, you can appreciate the, the, um, how do I say it? Inaka, like the country, this is kind of like the countryside, I guess I would say. Hey Trevor, good morning. Um, you know, and you still have like a city feel, you know, with all these uh, kind of areas around here. You know, lots of stores, of course. Um, so like, even though you're not in the Shinjuku or the Tokyo, like I call the downtown, the Yamanote Circle Line area, you know, you still have everything that you need out here. Um, you know, I, I always find a hub. But I knew this one was here because I drink here. The hub right up there, which is pretty cool. I want to explore more Tokyo whenever I get a chance to get there. He lost a friend. Yes, I did. I've actually, I hate to say this, but uh, I lost two friends in the last couple weeks, so kind of weird um, but yeah the hub I'll be going there tonight uh, I might actually live stream from there tonight but I'm not sure if that's appropriate uh, after being with all my friends and stuff um, but yeah as you can see all kinds of different things for those of you who are always wondering about uh, cigarettes but I know probably not all of you uh, actually smoke a typical vending machine and store which is closed because the shutter is down right now but you know, those are typical uh, vending machines. Um, and if you're ever wondering about what that is right there, uh, we call it a TASPO. Um, they basically, whoa, that was loud. Basically, you have to have a card um, that uh, you use. You, you have to sign up and send it into the government or whatever, saying that you're of age. So, so yeah, I'll be uh, up here always find the hub um, and it's a little bit of a rainy day it's not raining right now thank god but uh, yeah I'm just gonna uh, real quickly it's gonna be a short stream today guys um, and I, I want to I do want to apologize I know there's only 18 or 19 people right now but uh, I'm not gonna be uh, really in the mood I'm gonna try and live stream this week but uh, getting some vlogs out I do have, I posted a, a cocktail um, vlog last night. Um, I did, I actually went and did that a couple weeks ago. Uh, something like that, the end of October. Um, I guess that was just last week. Um, but I thought, it, you know, kind of interesting for anybody that does come uh, to Tokyo. You know, there are a lot of, oh, thank you so much. 
Thank you, Ram. Arigato gozaimashita. There are a lot of cheap drink areas. Now, there are izakayas where you can go and get 250 yen beer, but honestly, happy hour or, or the daytime uh, at the hub, which I always promote the hub, uh, 190 yen cocktails, which is like, you know, I put the prices, because somebody asked, actually asked me to, when I, when I talk about prices in yen, can you convert it into different uh, um, things like US or Canadian? So I kind of did the US, Canadian, uh, Aussie, Euro and the pound or sterling or whatever you call that, um, <coughs> which I will try to do more of. But uh, yeah, you know, like the hub is, it's a great atmosphere, I think anyways. Um, oh damn, stairs. I hate stairs, but I am a little fat, so maybe I should walk up those damn stairs. Um, you know, it, I know people like, oh, I'm going to Tokyo, but why would I go to a British pub? Well, yeah, it's themed after a British pub, but still Japanese, right? <laughs> Japanese staff, Japanese customers. And it's actually a pretty good vibe. Um, okay, here's the stairs I gotta go up. And being uh, six foot two, 250 pounds, and I just got water dripped all over me. Uh, so I'm gonna show you uh, what it looks like from up here. But, um, those cocktails were uh, pretty good. Well, some of them were anyway, so. Oh. See, I'm already huffing and puffing. Yes, I know, stop smoking, right? So here is uh, Tachikawa Station, as you can see here. <laughs> yeah, I should get free drinks, eh? I'm gonna go through there in a minute. I just wanna show you uh, kind of what's up upstairs here. A lot of walkways up here, which is still pretty cool. Ah, uh, little uh, Hui Kun kids. Pre-kindergarten. <coughs> so yeah, this is, uh, basically I was, started way over there, kind of walked around behind here, came around. I always love Japan because of the, uh, the TVs in there, right? 20 watching, please, please help. Drew by hitting the thumbs up, it's free. It's easy. Oh, I'm out of breath. Ah, and better than smashing your thumb with a hammer. <laughs> Thanks, Ram. That's awesome. <laughs> so yeah, this is uh, basically a countryside city. I'm not exactly sure, somebody can Google it, but how many people actually live in Tachikawa. I would guesstimate about 300,000, probably more, who knows. Oh, hi, Elizabeth. Thank you. Oh, 10 thumbs up, yay. So I'm just gonna walk to the other side, go through the station, walk through the other side. And uh, I don't know why these kids love looking out the window there, but. Um, so yeah, for those of you that are just joining, um, I'm in Tachikawa today, uh, wearing a suit, Oop, my collar. Um, I'm going to a memorial today. Uh, I found out a friend of mine uh, had passed away over the weekend, so uh, Tachikawa was full of memories for me. Uh, he did live out here, so that's why I'm here. Thank you so much for the support, people. So yeah, we're walking through the station here. Um, the department stores are not open yet. Uh, they open up at 10 o'clock, and the Grand Duo. Hey, Drew, we made it at Wendell Park right now near my hotel. Thanks for the inspiration to make this trip happen. Hey Richard, um, I'll just give you a private message right now through here is um, if you are available, I think Thursday evening, um, you wanna meet up at the Tokyo Dome Hub? That'd be pretty awesome. Uh, I think, or tomorrow I might have some time also. Depends on what time I finish work, so. Unfortunately, I think funeral or court date when I wear a suit, wear a suit, yeah, pretty much, right? So yeah, this is uh, the entrance, one, one side of the entrance to the uh, to the station. Of course, you got your ticket machines and all that over there. And uh, if you guys aren't familiar with how to buy tickets, I do have a video uh, about train travel here in Tokyo, but just to show you real quickly, you can buy all your tickets up here, but don't be, don't be afraid, really. Um, you know, that's the map of the Tokyo area of the JR lines. 
So you can see the red dot is over here. I live way over here. So it did take some time to uh, go. Actually, I'm surprised. Usually they have like a Japanese side and an English uh, side or Romaji side, but they don't today. Huh. And then just looking around, this, this is basically the morning. Uh, people coming out of the station. I've always loved this mural over here on the wall. I don't know why, but it's, I think it's pretty cool. Not sure what it's made out of, but uh, yeah. This is, uh, and this is nothing. This morning I was on a train where, you know, that, you know where you see videos of uh, the train attendants pushing people on the train to get the doors closed? That happened to me this morning and my God, by the time I got off the train, I was soaking wet just from all the humidity and uh, the heat from all the people and stuff. It was, it was just, it, it was gross. So, looks like they're setting up over here for something today. The rail line was very intimidating, but we figured it out and Google Maps literally walked us through. Good, 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 good. Yeah, did you land in, uh... oh hey Sean, thank you so much, dude. Thank you, arigato. Did you land in Haneda or uh, Narita, Richard? Because Narita would be a bitch. <laughs> Here's the other side of the station here. Um, I'm not sure which side I really, I like this side I think a bit better just because I'm more open to this side. Um, you got the big Isatan, uh, hey Corp, uh, shopping mall. You got all kinds of different shopping over there. Um, you know, once we walk down this street in a second, oh, it's raining too now, damn. And then down here is a pretty awesome uh, Irish pub, but I can't go down there because of time. I'm gonna walk under this, uh, this overhang here just to, just to uh, stay dry. But yeah, this is, uh, you know, and I, this, like I said earlier, you always got TVs blaring away somewhere in Japan. They're always around the station areas, which is still pretty cool. The one thing I should find out one day, because of all the, you know, hundreds of times, even living out here in the past, I never knew what this statue was all about. Maybe I'll go read it. How long are you going to stream for? Uh, probably another five or ten minutes. <coughs> Uh, I'm going to be a bit of a short stream. I might, I might stream later tonight. Just uh, checking it out. So it's, it's, it's uh, donated or something by the Lions Club. Good morning, Drew. Hey, Chuck. Thank you, bro. Channel's been doing good, kind of, right? I couldn't do Tokyo. Way too many people. Um, honestly, I'll tell you one thing right now. A lot of freaking people in Tokyo. But... Uh, <laughs> You get used to it, you really do. I hate morning travel and stuff, but um, it's not that bad actually. So, well, you get used to it, I, I guess, right? I don't get used to packed trains. I still get annoyed by it, but I guess I've, I've turned a bit Japanese where I've put up with it, I guess, so. So yeah, this is, uh, I need to get a coffee. That's what I really need to do, but I don't, oh, the Starbucks is way back that way. Yeah, they have Lions Club here. They actually have Boy Scouts of Boy Scouts here and Girl Guides, I think. I've seen Boy Scouts anyways, so. This is uh, basically all the different things. Um, it's a pretty wicked, uh, hey Brandon. It's a pretty wicked wine bar on the eighth floor in that building over there that I used to go to. Now it's raining, that sucks. Kinda love escalators outside though. I'm just gonna stand here like a retard. Yeah, scouts are really big. I see, I see them every weekend. So this is basically what I'm looking at uh, as I'm walking down. Tokyo is definitely the most organized and pedestrian friendly place I've ever been and an awesome Canadian tour guide. Why, thank you, Chuck. <laughs> I made you walk for like, what, three, four hours that day? <laughs> One of the big electronic stores, Bit Camera, of course. Uh, they're open already, I'm surprised. And who is that? Oh, Around Japan TV, hey. 
Hey, a Drew. Hey, uh, around Japan TV. We'll scout Jamboree in Japan about a year ago. Oh, okay. So yeah, this is a big camera, of course. And it's not open yet. You can see it says uh, 10 o'clock. So 10 to 9, they're open, it looks like. And you know what's really cool is I'm on the main road here. Richard Bagel, where are you staying in Japan? I think he said Weno. Ah, Cafe Voloce. I should go there. I, I'm actually going to go to a vending machine to get a coffee. Just because it's easy, cheap, and uh, not bad. Oh, I thought there was something down here. I guess not. So I'm going to turn around. You look fancy. What's going on? Um, just in a, a few words, uh, I'm going to Memorial tonight. Oh, good. The light changed, too. <laughs> the loft a decent uh, that's how expensive Starbucks is yeah exactly I'm gonna go get like a dollar forty coffee instead of out of a vending machine the loft guys a great store to shop at um, you know reasonably priced uh, not too expensive well cafe de Crete. but I know there's vending machines right around the corner here digging into my pocket to get a change well wow, 30 people that's pretty awesome um, but yeah, to answer your question, I'll reiterate one more time, uh, in a black suit, black tie, um, an unfortunate accident happened with a friend of mine over the weekend and, uh, I'm going to a memorial. So, uh, it's a sad thing, but I'm out here, to, uh, just walking around Tachikawa. I started the stream off at a restaurant where, uh, the gentleman and I, uh, being friends for 12 years, um, Spend, spent a few uh, hours talking and uh, I'm looking for the cheapest coffee now. Um, and I'm into like basically all kinds of uh, vending machines. Dollar forty looks like the cheapest. Mm. These ones don't have the Pasmo uh, thing here so you know, if you ever come to Japan, here's just a little bit of advice. You'll see, obviously, the blue and the red. Uh, red obviously means hot, um, just in case. When I first came to Japan, as uh, smart as I think that I want to be sometimes, I didn't understand what the, uh, what the red and uh, the blue meant, to be honest. Um, and in the summertime, you're never going to see red, obviously. Who wants to drink hot, hot coffee? Uh, in the summertime. I'm just going to put the gimbal down here. I actually kept my stand uh, instead of boring it from uh, the live stream gentleman that I was with the other day. Um, just for the fact that... Uh, there we go. No hat! <laughs> Hi Sierra! Um, keep an eye out. I didn't see the comments, sorry. But, uh, you know, honestly, what I... You know, like getting away from that. Sorry for your loss. Anyone we know? No, it's not. Um, save R, thank you. Um, have you been to a Yamiuri Giants game? I have, um, but I'm not a Giants fan. I'm a Cebu Lions fan, Saitama. I like my coffee, like I like my women, cheap, easy and cheap. <laughs> New video coming sometime this week. Hey, uh, awesome. New video coming out uh, around Japan. I don't know, have I subscribed to your channel? If not, um, I'd actually like, when people subscribe to me and oh my God, like, you know, I got to meet a great guy on Saturday. Y'all know, cause half of you subscribed to him. and probably came over from his channel, uh, only in Japan for uh, John Dobb. Um, is it acceptable to smoke while walking around? No, but I do. And that's my bad habit, and I shouldn't do it, but I do. Um, I'm very ignorant that way and stubborn. Um, Steelers fan. Oh, yes, Steelers! And Sierra sees in the chat as a Steelers fan. I'm a Steelers fan. And uh, we won, thank God. But, you know, like, my, um, my football pool that I'm in, I'm in last place out of 12th bad draft I've been dropping players and it's just like uh, I had 70 when I was in uh, 
Shibuya and Halloween, I was up to like 77 people or something like that. It was like, wow, that's awesome. Um, and then on Saturday when I bumped into John, um, you know, I just wanted to say hi. A couple people actually mentioned uh, like, hey, why are you uh, ruining, ruining his live stream? But I had no intention of, um, you know, dis disturbing. I just wanted to say hi. But he's always said, like, if you see me around, come say hi, right? So I, I happened to be live streaming at the same time. I didn't want to shut that off. Um, so for anybody that seems like, uh, you know, it was a bad thing to do or I offended you, I, I, I do apologize. Um, that was not my intention. Um, but it was nice to buy him a beer and um, uh, just, you know, finally meet the guy that uh, I look up to as uh, a person that, uh, you know, is very interesting about Japan. A lot of my ideas, uh, I watch John religiously. Um, so a lot of my ideas, like, you know, I two weeks ago I went to uh, the little peeing boy at Hamamatsu Cho and because he did that. So I thought I would do that for my subscribers, right? Um, and, uh, you know, because we're not all subscribed to the same people, obviously, right? Well, I'm subscribed to like 200 channels of Japanese people, pretty much, but you know, hey. I'm a good friend of John's and he had no problem with it. Well, good, thank I'm glad, uh, thank you for reassuring me because, um, and actually right now, like after we did the live stream, I talked to John because uh, even though he's like, you know, a million fans on only, only in Japan and uh, what is it, like a, 100,000 on only in Japan go. I asked him for, for my website, tokyojoo.com, um, you know, can I put you in the creator spotlight? Um, and he's like, yeah, sure, man. So, you know, right now on tokyojoo.com, uh, I put his profile on there um, and one of his videos, uh, I think it was Oka Sawara, which was an awesome video. Like, the guy is amazing. So. But yeah, that's uh, basically what I am here today doing. And um, I thought, uh, just, I'm, in the, I'm in an alley having a smoke before I go to my office. <laughs> so I got to uh, hurry up here. Um, and honestly, I'm gonna smoke, I'm gonna smoke. You know, a lot of people are like, don't smoke, or you know, don't do this, or don't do that. Well, at 51 years old, um, I'm just gonna put the camera back down again, sorry. Um, I just do what I do, I keep it real, that's all. So, and I appreciate a lot of uh, people that have been coming over uh, lately, like I have tremendously grown, and you know, that is, it makes you feel like you, you know, you're being, you're doing something good, you're giving value to people. And you know, there's a lot of creators that are out there that talk about it, yeah, 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 yeah. And uh, hey, good morning, Mumu. Um, I just do what I do, and I love sharing this wonderful country with you guys. And uh, don't smoke this and that. <laughs> <coughs> and uh, like a lot of people, um, you know, honestly, in the last uh, well, a couple months uh, since August, at the end of August, Chuck and Paige from uh, No Time to Be Sad came over, and a few of their subscribers came over and enjoy what I do. Uh, I did another collab uh, at Fat Burger with Paul from Critical, Critical East Japan and a few people came over and have been, uh, you know, um, saying, hey, you know, pretty good vids, you know, you're pretty cool or you're pretty humble, you know, whatever. And then a bunch of people came over from uh, John's channel and, you know, creating, helping create the community, which is pretty cool. So, um, yeah, I just want to grow. Oh, damn. I just saw something I never knew was here. Paul Skywalker, yeah. <laughs> I didn't know that the First Kitchen, if anybody's familiar First Kitchen, and Wendy's are now teamed up, so. All right, let's go. And I just, this is what I noticed, was I, I saw Wendy's uh, logo sitting there. And I was like, oh damn, that's pretty cool. Gotta love Wendy's, and I miss Wendy's from back home. I used to eat a triple cheese and bacon every day, once a day, for a diet. So, but uh, yeah, I'm gonna cut the stream short, guys. Um, just for the fact that I have to get to work. Um, and my office is just across the street here. So, uh, what's First Kitchen? Just another burger place. 
Um, I don't know, they got like Mossberger, First Kitchen, Lotteria. It's kind of crap, in my opinion. But Wendy's? Mm -hmm. But I don't eat that much fast food, actually. Even though I've done a couple of vlogs on fast food, McDonald's burgers and the fat burger and stuff, I prefer to cook at home. So, But uh, yeah, I'm walking across the uh, intersection here. Don Quixote right over there, the black and yellow sign, which is pretty cool. And there's all department stores here, so. And a 7-Eleven right up there. Actually, this used to be a bank a long time ago. And now it's a uh, suit place, Aoyama, which is actually where I bought the suit I'm wearing. Not at this store, but. Um, but yeah, guys, uh, I'm out here. Tachika was full of memories. Um, I hope you enjoyed this little 30 minute walk around. Uh, thank you very much, uh, Ram and Sean for the uh, chat super chats um, I might go live tonight um, but yeah check out uh, tokyodrew.com if you can uh, you can register up uh, and check out what I do over there I try and integrate uh, the channel and my website at the same time and I do have a big announcement coming uh, in a few days so uh, I'll be doing a premiere video for that <coughs> and uh, until then keep it real keep it raw I will see you soon Stay true to yourself, guys. Have a good day. Or night. Or evening. Or something. Later, guys. Bye.